why am I going to watch a John Wick spin-off starring Anna de Armas? 4K Ultra HD. So the key pull of John Wick is this man is doing all those stunts. Um, John Wick is a big movie for me. John Wick, you have to understand how important John, John, John Wick is. John Wick is one of the most important genre films ever made. One of, not the most, but one of the most important genre films ever made. Because if you're an action movie junkie like me, where you've watched the Seagal movies, you've watched the Van Damme movies, and you see the kind of brick, shaky cam trash that was happening, and then John Wick comes along and brings in full appreciation for action, appreciation for action choreography. All this is in a very important film. And I'll tell you how key John John Wick is. 4K Ultra HD, all three films. That's, see, 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 that's how real I am. No, wait, wait, all four films. All four films. That, that's how real your, 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 your boy is. I have this on 4K Ultra HD. No, it is a digital so 4K Ultra HD. Ultra HD. So, well, I've, I've, I've got it on. So, John Wick is, it's a, it's a, it's a big deal. John Wick, amazing. John Wick chapter two, that's my, my favorite. So, John Wick Chapter 2 is one of the best action films of all time. Of all time. John Wick 3, it's cool, boy. And John Wick 4, outstanding. Outstanding. Absolutely outstanding. <laughs> so putting them all together, it is, bro, I told you, I cannot wait to, to watch all these, all these four films. Because I, I have my Bose Sandbar 900. I've got my 4K TV. It gets real. It gets real. I've got my surround system. It gets real. I can't wait to watch this stuff. I'm, I'm, I'm actually watching it tonight, actually. And one of the key guys to thank about this, pop quiz guys, do you know that Charles Stahelski, who was the guy who directed, so him and David Leach co-directed the first film, then he took, he took sole directing duties on two, three, and four. Do you know that he was, so he was Keanu Reeves' stunt double in The Matrix, and he also filmed the rest of the scenes after Brandon Lee died on the set of The Crow, because he was really good friends with Brandon Lee. So, this guy, martial artist, I believe his first film might have been Bloodsport with Van Damme, because he was in that film, Bloodsport. So he's been a, a stunt choreographer, a um, stunt double for a long time. So he has an appreciation for action, a true love for action, and you can see the kind of love and care he has for the genre in those absolutely outstanding films. You see, those John Wick films show you somebody who has a passion and truly cares about the action genre. So all these idiotic um, Hollywood directors that just bring in shit and be like, oh, let, let's just film whatsoever. There's no love there. You can see the love because no, it's a skill. Filming action choreography is a, is a skill. Go ask Chris Nolan. This great, amazing Chris Nolan. Chris Nolan is arguably one of the worst as direction, at directing action choreography. Chris Nolan's action choreography is amongst the worst I've ever seen in my life. It's garbage. So yes, yeah, shout out to, you know, Inception, it's a stellar. His action choreography is garbage. But when you watch John Wick, you say, no, no, this is excellent action choreography. So you better see guys, because I'm, I'm trying to build up. I'm building up to where I'm going here. And, bro, a big deal of why John Wick works, and this is a, a, it's a massive deal, is Keanu Reeves. Keanu Reeves is not a good actor. He's not. Keanu Reeves is one of the worst actors out there. And I'm just calling it, killing it real. Again, Keanu Reeves may hate me for saying this. It is what it is. I'm just here to, to, to keep it a stack. He's a, he is a bad actor. He's one of the worst. But... In terms of dedication, hardworking, how nice of a guy he is, what Keanu Reeves achieved in the Matrix films 
is astonishing. Do you know, before the first Matrix film, he had no history in martial arts. He had no history in, in, in fighting. He was just a regular Hollywood star. He'd done Points Break. He'd done Bill and Ted. He'd done Speed. So he was just a big movie star, but he had nothing to do with the martial arts. So from zero learning nothing to learning martial arts, most of that Matrix film he did, the first one, was with a broken back because he had a motorcycle accident. Guys, go and watch Reloaded and watch what this guy does in that film. And this is a man who knew no martial arts. So the key pull of John Wick is this man is doing all those stunts. He's doing all those moves. He's all that choreography. It's him. It's not a stunt double. There's no shaking him and starts to help. It's key because I can now film wide. I can film a master. I don't have to cut around him. I don't have to edit around him because it is really him doing those judo moves. Shout out to Ipon Senagi. Those judo moves. It's him doing those throws, those, those, those kicks. It's him reloading the gun. So it is such a new experience for Hollywood films saying, oh no, no, this is like how they do in the Hong Kong movies. Because it's really Jackie Chan doing that. It's really Jet Li doing that. It's, it's, it's really, Guys, have you watched Tony Chow on back? Have you watched what Tony Chow does in Ong Bak? It's real. No, yeah, it's real. So that's the pull. It's like, no, this guy is your star is really doing this amazing stuff. He's not getting some stunts double to do it, who you can't show. It's him. So I say all that to say. I haven't watched the trailer. I will never watch the trailer. I will never watch the film. This film doesn't exist to me. It does like this film, it doesn't, it's it doesn't exist to me. Like I don't even know it's it doesn't exist. Because why am I gonna watch a John Wick spin-off starring Anna de Armas? I know you don't know any martial arts or kung fu. I know you're not going to do any of those moves. And I know even if you do those moves, you ain't going to do it as, as well as your boy. Because before he did John Wick, six months of kung fu training with um, Wu Ping's stunts team. Wu Ping, one of the great stunts coordinators. Six months of hardcore training. So Keanu Reeves is a martial artist. <laughs> he has been trained with the best. I know for a fact he ain't done any of that training. So I don't even need to view anything. To, no, no, I know that you've not put in the work or put in the effort. So this is just some weird ass style vehicle. I'm going to say something rude. And please, guys, don't say it personally. How can I say this? Screw, I'll just say it. If this was like an erotic film, shout to Sharon Stone. Um, was it, what's it called? It's Slither with, um, I think, with William Baldwin. Or was that with Michael Douglas? It's like some kind of erotic film or something. Oh, hey, you know, that, that works well. You know? John Wick spin-off. Guy, like, guy, guys, do you know what John Wick is? Guys, do you know do you know what this move? I don't think, you know what I'm gonna say, Anna Dermas. I want to say Anna. Do you know what this film is? See, if she knew what this film was, she'd be like, no, nah, I can't take the role. <laughs> I'm sorry. I can't like, get someone else. If she knew what this... She obviously doesn't know what this film was. She was like, oh yeah, John Wick's been up with a famous film. Oh, it's all cool. Boom. No, if you really understood what this film is, then she knows that, oh, no, no, no. I'm not I'm not right for this role. I'm not right for this film. I don't belong in, in, in this world. I don't. Um, so, guys, I have zero interest in this. Absolute zero interest in this. I couldn't... I couldn't... I couldn't scale less. Like, it's stupid. It's completely and utterly stupid, and it's an insult to what this is. What I'm waiting for is this. Now, this is the spin-off I'm waiting for. Your boy, Donnie Yen. I, I follow him on Instagram. Yeah, I follow him on Instagram. Um, I, I think you've all seen, um, oh gosh, what's, what's, what's the name of Ip Man. Yeah, Donnie Yen's that dude. Yeah. His, his, Donian is that dude. Donian's performance in John Wick. What this man did in John Wick 4. Ah, yeah, 
yeah, yeah. Like, what's this guy did show me? Because I, cause I saw, saw him for cinema. I'm like, yeah, yeah, yeah. So, yeah, I'm waiting for his his, his spinoff. I'm pr- and I'm hoping that his spinoff is directed by Charles Sahelsky. That's why I'm, I'm praying. Charles Sahelsky directing that stuff. Get a good quality writer. Donnie Yen. Ooh, I'm in. And here's the thing. If they just announce that Stahelsky is directing, because that is very important. I don't want any other... Stahelsky is directing. Donian is starring. I don't need to watch the trailer. My ticket's already bought. I'm already, I've, I've already bought my ticket. I don't need to know the story of the trailer. I don't, I don't care. The trailer is irrelevant. My ticket is already bought. I'm there. I'm there. So again, shout out to Anna, man. Like again, here's the thing. Do you? Guys, it's, it's a free world. It's a free world. Do you? I'm not watching. I don't care about the film. The film doesn't exist to me. But for people who want to watch it, hey, go for it. People who are fans of Anna de Armas, people who think that the trailer looks good, please go and watch it. I'm not saying, no, no, no. I would never say, no, don't go and watch it. That's just me being a prick. No. If you like Anna de Armas, or you like the trailer, or you like the look of the movie, or you like the idea of the story, please go and watch. But for me, no, no, no. The, the film doesn't, it doesn't exist to me. I am counting down the days to Donnie Yen. And Charles, Charles Elsky director, I know Star Helsky, he's doing the Highland film, the Highland remake, which I don't know why he's doing that. Hope Lazarus is doing that. Oh no. Then, bro. Why if they announce the Helsky Donny, you know? Ah, yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm there. I'm there. I am right there, right there. I am absolutely there. So, guys, what I'm saying though is <laughs> look, John Wick is not a joke. <laughs> so, those, those films are, John, it's 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 not a it's, it's not for play play. It's not a joke. It's a serious movie. It's a serious movie. So with Anna Demas, that's a joke. Like that's comedy. I mean, that that is a comedy. <laughs> you know, that's that's like a comedy skit. It ain't a joke. So yeah, man. Announce Donnie Yen, and you'll get my money.